Welcome to another edition of Designing Spaces, the show that's all about you and your space, your home and surroundings. I'm Debbie Murray. Yeah, she is, and I'm David Jones. Today's Designing Spaces goes high tech with a look at some wonderful solutions to the digital lifestyle and to make your home a safe and secure living space. And that includes the home office. Maybe your home-based business is starting to take off and you need help with establishing your company identity. Help is on the way, and it's coming from a familiar name to just about anyone in business. Plus, we get to have some high-tech fun by bringing a new dimension to your home entertainment system. I mean, if you're into movies or gaming, you're going to want to see this, believe me. And do you want to learn another language? See. Si. There you go. You don't have to go to school. It can all be done at your own pace, right in the comfort of your own home. Some interesting technology makes learning more effective and efficient. Oh, and we have some new computer memory enhancements that will blow you away. So stick around and see it all right here on Designing Spaces. One big problem for that small business run from your home office is your company identity. You need letterheads, business cards, flyers, and catalogs, all of which should be a reflection of your business image. With the help of one familiar name, you can achieve professional results. Here's Kirsten Hill with the story. You've got your home business up and running, and you're a one-person operation with the occasional volunteers. However, the reality of running a business is setting in, and you feel you need to do more marketing and public relations. You started on the computer, but now you need business cards, stationery, brochures, and other marketing materials. And then there's all the packages that must be sent out in a timely manner. Designing Spaces wants your home office to be an efficient one, so we teamed up with someone who can help you with all these areas. We've got today Chris, who's joining us, and she's right at that stage in her business right now. Also joining us today on Designing Spaces is Lisa, and Lisa's from FedEx Office. Lisa can tell us a little bit more how we can get our businesses looking professional and polished. So, what can she actually do to really help define herself to her customers? Well, we are actually here within a FedEx office location, and we're so much more than just copy and print services. One of the things that you want to keep in mind as you're starting your own home-based business is keeping your brand and your message to your customers consistent. Chris also, being at the beginning stages of her business, I, she's a smaller business. How can she appear bigger and compete with larger businesses? I love that question and we get that question all the time. One of the key things that you want to do is create professional, polished marketing materials that help you separate yourself from everybody else that's out there. Now, you bring up a valid point. You are at the beginning stage of your business, and we pretty much have got the marketing down, but how does she actually grow her customer base? You know, there are several products that we have within our FedEx office locations, and you can access those online from your home business. Some of the basics are obviously business cards and letterhead, but it goes so much farther than that. But for you that's looking to attract attract a bigger, broader audience, you're thinking about presentations, proposals, even things like direct mail. If you want to come over here, here's one of the tools that we have that makes this very simple for you. It's our Design and Print Center. It's going to open up a whole world of options for you. Now, with smaller businesses starting out, not necessarily having the income to hire a professional artist to design all of their marketing materials, do they, are they forced into using the planned look? Absolutely not. With the Design and Print Center, we literally have thousands of templates available online where Chris can pick and choose what she needs to create the image that she's trying to achieve. I'd love to show you a couple of the things about it right now. As you can see right here on our Design and Print Center, there are several options that you have available. Right here, we can do business cards. You can select whatever kind you want. You can browse the gallery. There are over 500 mm -hmm. options available to you right here. And so you can select the one that you like the most that 
it reflects the image that you want and all we would have to do is add your own personal information right here and within seven days it would be delivered right back to your home office. Now with um, you know all this demand of marketing online are younger businesses or smaller businesses actually still sending out business cards and brochures? Is that even necessary? They do. You know what? It is so important to have those face-to-face -face meetings where you're really building that customer relationship where you work to understand what their needs are and bring the power of your business to them. How many people are really still sending brochures and business cards and packages out lately? Well, let me ask you this. When you went home from work last night, how many direct mail pieces were in your mailbox? You know, that's a good question. It is that's, a good question, yes, isn't yes. it? So you know what, Chris, I have some other exciting things to show you that you can access within your local FedEx office center or online in your home office. Why don't you come with me? Great. All right, Lisa, so what's going on here? Chris, obviously we're here today to talk about how we can help you build your brand and help build your business. We've already talked about our design and print center, and what I want to show you right now is FedEx office print online. What it is, is it is a tool available to you, obviously online, where you can upload your documents that you're creating in the comfort of your own home office. Marketing materials such as trifold brochures, business cards, the direct mail pieces that we talked about, all so important in building your brand and building up your customer base. We also talked about the importance of in-person meetings where you're really developing that customer relationship. So things like product information and proposals are just critical for that. All of this you can do in the comfort of your own home office, upload the documents and print it here at your local FedEx office where you can pick it up at your convenience. Wow, fantastic. Thank you so much. I'm actually really looking forward to refreshing my business image and my marketing concepts using all of these wonderful tools. That's great. And you know what? We are here to help. You don't have to do it alone. Part of the FedEx office experience actually includes courier pickup and delivery straight to your home office. In fact, we have a service called Hold It Location where it allows you to have your packages shipped here at your local FedEx office center from your vendors or customers and we'll hold them until you're ready to pick them up. We'll give you a phone call right when they're available. Lisa, this is great. Thank you so much for all of this information and for anyone who might want more information, where would they be able to find that? We are available online at fedex.com forward slash office where you can explore the possibilities. Nice. And you can also find a link to them at designingspaces.tv. For Designing Spaces, I'm Kirsten Hill. Today it was a good show. I feel like I've got caught up on some of the latest technology that will affect our homes and lifestyles. And you know what? We have even more coming up in the near future, but our next show is going to take us in a totally different direction. Don't miss it. Until next time, I'm David Jones. And I'm Debbie Marie. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. For more information about anything you've seen on today's show or to find out how to be part of the show, log on to designingspaces.tv. Follow us on Twitter at twitter.com slash dspacesTV or friend us on Facebook. Type in the words Designing Spaces. You can visit these websites to learn more about the participants on this edition of Designing Spaces.